and motivator Speak nothing but the truth Tell them how my life was through My life was up and down That's why I'm speaking now Look at my YouTube page I'm gonna motivate you when you had them bad days Hey, 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 hey Hey, 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 hey it's your boy J. Michael with another V I D E O. Hit that subscribe button, the dislike button, the notification. I don't care how you feel, just keep it real the real you know, ass way. Now, y'all see what's been going on in these YouTube streets, YouTube alleys, YouTube kitchen. I'm in the kitchen right now. Let's talk about the games and the reality. Everybody at odds with each other right now. Why? Why is everybody going at each other? Because everybody that was in that pit was all snakes. So, why y'all getting mad? Because to keep it 100, everybody that's talking and going at each other really didn't know each other. Y'all met each other on YouTube. Y'all became so-called friends on YouTube. What I don't understand is <clears throat> how can people go to bat? I mean, go to war. I mean, get dirt right grimy for a person they really don't even know that really don't even care about them help me understand that people these people out here was going to bat they say one thing wrong then look what happened all hell break out they talking about scamming Right? I got scammed. People were scamming me. This and this and that. Okay, let's talk about this scam. First off, the person said they had a book. They might, they might have a book. They might not have a book. We don't know. Or some people do know. I just don't know. Let's say it like that. But, when you open up a restaurant or any place of business, you're going to promote it. You're going to promote it, promote it, promote it, promote it, promote it, promote it. Even while the building is getting fixed or why, why it's in the, in, in the process of being product, in, in, in production mode, you're still going to promote it. It's just not going to pop up out the blue like, hey, I'm here. That's how you get people ready for your product. It's because you're going to promote it months in and months out. You're going to promote that whatever you got you want to sell. You're going to promote it. Right? And then you say you get scammed. How can a person get scammed? Well, I ain't going to say that because they can, but just my opinion. If you got a team, you shouldn't have got scammed. Unless them people you saying scam you was your team. Because if you got a promoting team, a production team, and agents and lawyers, you shouldn't have got scammed. Because you got all these lawyers on your team, you got all this promoting people on your team. So how would you get scammed if you got all these heavy hitters on your team? Now, and the scamming, this for, is this for the people. You have people out there that scamming. True enough, yeah, they do, every day. But, people can run game to you all day, up, down, sideways, right, left, whatever. Under the ground, on the roof, whatever. They can run game all day. But it's up to you to send that money. So you can't get scammed 
if you don't fall for their games. You can't get scammed if you don't if you don't fall for their wordplay. You can't get scammed if you don't send your money. You get what I'm saying? So when you get scammed, a lot of that falls on you for being gullible, for being soft-hearted without doing your research and making sure stuff is legit. You got a lot of people that got kind hearts that like looking out for people. And them be the ones that get hurt because they, they feel they're doing the right thing, but y'all have evil intentions. Y'all can't do people like that because you have true people out there that really want to help people. That's really doing it from the kindness of their heart, trying to do the right thing and y'all playing. Why? Huh? But yet, all y'all say, J. Michael this, J. Michael that, J. Michael's a hater, J. Michael's a clout chaser. Now look, these the same people that be on their live going in on J. Michael, going in on them, they reactions. J. Michael this, J. Michael that, ah, this and this and that. Look how the tables have turned. What J. Michael been trying to tell all y'all from the beginning. This is nothing but a game. And they play it well. And y'all fall for it. If it ain't benefiting them, they don't care who they stump on. They don't care who they got to jump over. It's all about money and them looking good. That's all it's about. You get what I'm saying? Come on now, y'all. Just think about it. They made videos saying they won't go talk about each other no more. They won't go put each other business on their, on the internet no more. But yet they did it. Then you have people say, "Oh, it's not a series. It's not this. It's not that. They going to war. Oh, it's not. It's it's it's, it's nothing like that. No, no, no." If I tell you it is a series, then it won't be interesting, really, because then y'all gonna be like, oh, we know it's fake. But if I present it to y'all like it's real, then y'all gonna y'all gonna tune in even more. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna tune in compared to, oh, we know it's fake, we know it's a series, so I'll watch it just for the entertainment purpose, but. It ain't going to really hit me here because I know it's fake. See, the difference in me telling y'all it's fake, then the difference in me saying and make y'all feel it's real. If I, convince, if I can convince y'all that it's real, it's going to hit harder than y'all knowing it's fake. Come on now. Come on now. Think about it, people. They've been in the YouTube game for a while now. They know what to do and what not to do. They know how to finagle and squeeze through the cracks. But y'all the ones that be gullible and fall for it. Y'all. Everybody want to throw these receipts out there now. Uh, this person said this. This person said that. Why y'all doing that now? Because... They, they threw y'all under the bus? Y'all upset? Huh? Why? Why y'all doing it now? The same people that's playing the games and was playing the games, y'all the ones got the receipts, so y'all knew it was a game from the beginning because all y'all was in cahoots together. So why is y'all getting mad now when they expose everything when y'all knew it was a game? Don't get your feelings hurt now and y'all knew it was a game from the beginning. So what? You, you, you trying to make yourself look good now. All y'all trying to make yourself look good now by with these receipts. But all y'all concocted all this plan to y'all. Y'all concocted this story and put this plan together. When people kept telling y'all who was behind the scenes, who was in the cracks, who was in the bushes with the binoculars, who was sitting on the roof with the binoculars. 
Everybody kept saying it, but no, no, no. All y'all want to go to war with all these individuals. And now y'all sitting in the woods all alone. Trying to find out how to dust y'all self off. You get what I'm saying? Now y'all see that this person really didn't care about none of y'all. It's all about them. It's all about what benefits they pocket and what make them look good. Something J. Michael kept trying to tell y'all from the jump. It's, it's nothing wrong with giving reactions. It's nothing wrong with voicing y'all opinion on videos that y'all see. The problem come in when y'all start trying to expose people's secrets, expose what people share with y'all, expose what people that what, what people trying to get off their chest and share with the world. That's when the problem come in when y'all think y'all trying to make yourself look good by throwing it back up in their face, but really making yourself look dumb. Y'all think it's he he and ha ha and goo goos and gagas. When y'all, when somebody shares something with y'all, y'all want to, oh yeah, you got this, oh yeah, huh? that don't make y'all look good, that make y'all untrustworthy. That make y'all look this little, it make y'all look like the fool. But to y'all, y'all think y'all doing something good because y'all got all these people in, on y'all live and in y'all bushes. Oh yeah, you right, they, yeah, you right, they should have did that, oh he done, ha uh -huh. Boosting y'all ego up. So y'all think it's cool when people share something with y'all and then y'all want to expose it. Like I say all the time, if people be real with people and, and quit being fake with people, then people will know how to look at themselves better. You get what I'm saying? People will know how to look at themselves better. You have to realize what's going on in these streets. You'll find some legitimate people, some real, real people, but most of this is about games. A lot of these people that's on, that's on this YouTube, that's in this mix, they don't know reality from the games. They don't know the games from reality. Because they done lied and played so many games, it's a norm to them now. It's part of their repertoire. You see? And people sit back in the bushes and they sit back and they watch. Like I was saying, people sit back and they watch in the bushes while all this drama unfolds. Then they throw their little comments out there. If it's a good comment or if it's a joking comment or if it's a disrespectful comment. People sit back in the bushes because they know they ain't going to be seen. They know people don't know who they are. So they're going to say whatever they want to say. Long as they keep the drama stirred up. If people was real with these individuals from jump, wouldn't none of this be unfolding right now? If people wouldn't have been kissing everybody's ass, telling them, oh, you right, you this, uh-huh, they wrong, girl, they crazy, oh, this and this and that. But been real, then y'all probably would have seen a different outcome. But can't nobody be real? Because they think if I say something about this person, they not gonna give me a shout out. If I say something about this person, they not gonna help me. They weren't gonna help you from job. They wasn't. They was just doing what they can do to keep themselves clean. But now everything is coming out. Everybody running like roaches now because the light then came on. Y'all know when y'all cut the light on roaches, they scatter. That's what everybody doing now. Everybody trying to find a way to, to make themselves come out of clean and point the fingers at everybody. But everybody they point the finger at, all y'all in cahoots together. All y'all. Y'all have to understand That y'all all say the same thing. Erica is young. 
Y'all old enough to be her mom. Y'all old enough to be her daddy. That woman have three children. That woman know what she's doing. Y'all gotta stop using that excuse of she's young. Y'all gotta, when, when, when Wicked was doing what she was doing, all y'all was on her bandwagon. All y'all was on the bandwagon. Everybody's shocked now. Shocked for what? They was putting it right in y'all face. So what is y'all shocked for? For something that y'all seen. That unfolded. Y'all should have just been sitting back waiting. That's all y'all should have been sitting back. Y'all shouldn't be surprised. Y'all should be like, well, I didn't know when, I didn't know how, I didn't know where, when it was going to explode. Because anytime somebody, yes sir, yes sir, master, uh-huh, when a person don't do no wrong in that person's eyes, y'all know it's a game. That, that lets you know somebody is being fake. Because if a person can't take constructive criticism or give you constructive criticism, somebody's being fake in all that scenario. You should be grown enough or woman enough or man enough to know how to take constructive criticism or give constructive criticism without getting mad. Because that's the game, ain't it? But no. Everybody that spoke the real about what was going on, they was haters. They was clout chasers. They didn't want to, they didn't want to see people rise. They, they want to see people fall. They want to see people fold. What y'all got to say now? What's, what's y'all reason? What's y'all excuse now? What's y'all explanation now? With everything unfolding. Oh, I know what it is now. People still choosing sides. And pointing the finger at each way. Study being in the middle. Being neutral. And looking at the logic. And seeing everybody is in this mess together. And step back and get yourself out the equation. Y'all still choosing sides. Y'all still pointing fingers at people. Oh, um, why they do Eric like that? Oh, why they doing Wicked like that? Oh, now they bringing AB in it. Why? Leave it alone. All the individuals know what they did and they know what part they played in this. So all the fans out there that's in the bushes, all the fans that's, that's not fans but just watching it without subscribing and all that, Stay out of it. Don't choose sides. Just watch it. Don't even leave comments saying anything on nobody's side. Because all them people know what they did and how they did it. They know this. It's a game. They can get lost in this game and forget about reality. They live in this game now, this fiction, this fantasy, and forget what reality really looked like. Because everybody want this. Everybody want that fame. Everybody want that attention. Everybody want to be somebody. But you are somebody. When you wake up in the morning and you look in that mirror, you are somebody. You might not be a superstar. You might not be a mega star, but you are somebody. Love you. Understand you. Know reality from the games. Quit telling lies and believe in your own lies. Because you have a lot of people out there that can tell a lie and they believe that lie. And they start living that lie. Study looking at reality. This is YouTube. Entertainment. Some people share their life. Some people make up their life. Some people cook. Some people do pranks. It's a lot of stuff that you can learn from YouTube besides this drama. It's a lot we can do. I 
I mean, good series? Yeah, I mean, good series is good series. And we know when it's good series because it don't be personal. Y'all got to stop making stuff personal and bring it back to reality. Bring it back to the fun. Bring it back to the entertainment. The more y'all go back and forth, the worse it's going to get. The worse. Y'all smack, y'all small platforms, y'all not going to be able to compete with these big platforms. Because at the end of the day, they're going to choose the big platform over you any day. So if I was y'all, I would stop it. Go back and do what I was doing on my channel and leave these big platforms alone. Because you can be dead right, you can have the evidence in their face, but they still going to choose that bigger platform over you any day. You get what I'm saying? You have some people feel people doing better than them, so they got to put this front on like they doing good. Because they don't want the world to think they doing bad. Just be real with yourself. If you're not doing good, if you're living mediocre, so what? It ain't everybody destiny to be rich. It ain't everybody destiny to be a big YouTuber. You might have other plans. Focus on what, what you know you know how to do. Focus on what you need to do. Focus on your family. Focus on what you do on your page and you know what you do good. trying to sabotage people's lives. Quit trying to do this he say, she say crap. Because it ain't going to do nothing. Because people still going to watch it. People still going to be entertained by it. But all y'all doing is hurting y'all reputation. Y'all making it hard for people to want to work with y'all. That's what y'all doing out here. Y'all don't know who in the bush is watching like, damn, I really want to work with that person. But no, nah, that person is messy. No, oh, I can't trust that person. I bring that person into my circle. That person might be get mad at me and expose me all on YouTube. Y'all hurting y'all brand. That's what y'all doing. With this he say, she say. If Erica had a book, if Erica didn't have a book, so what? If she got scammed, that ain't for y'all to talk about. That's for her to figure out. But if she got this team and she got these lawyers, they going to figure it out. Come on. And if y'all was dumb enough to send y'all money without doing the research, that's on y'all. That ain't nobody's fault but y'all fault for sending money to a person without doing the research on it. Come on. Think about it. Think about it. Y'all ain't new to these, this, this, this world, the real world. People scam every day. So why would you send money without finding out the real? If it's a real book, $60? Come on, that right there would have threw a red flag up with me. $60? Shit, you, 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 got, you got number one bestsellers out there that don't go for $60. You got some people that got number one bestselling books out there that don't even charge. They, they, they do signings and y'all just buy the book and they sign the book. That's how they get their money. They don't charge you to come see them. You got some do, but the, the, the big ones, they sit at a location that they chose or something. They had a table set up, had a box of books set up, and they sign the book and you buy the book. That's what they do. And it don't be no $60. Come on. Think about it, people. They got, they got big platforms. They should have been promoting this book for months in and months out. They should have been promoting this. While the book was in, in, in production mode, they should have been promoting it. The cover should have been, that cover should have stayed on every video that they made. 
That, that, that cover should have been in every community post. That, 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 that book should have been on that page and the other page, on both pages, on Cryer page and her page. That book should have been being promoted. Promoted, 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 promoted. So when it did drop, it wouldn't have. I'm not going to sit there and sugarcoat nothing with nobody. If you're my partner, if you're just a friend, or if you're an enemy, I'm going to let you know how I feel. That's the only way a person going to learn if you tell them the right. And again, like I said, why are y'all surprised about what Wicked did? Or why are y'all surprised by what Wicked said? Why? Why y'all surprised about what Erica said? Why y'all are surprised about what Erica did? Help me understand these people. Huh? Everybody want to be good, good, good little boys and girls when it come to these big platforms. They be scared to tell these big platforms what they doing wrong. They be scared to tell these big platforms, hey, that wasn't right, because they gonna cut me off or they gonna block me. So what? Ain't none of them paying your bills. Ain't none of them feeding you. Come on, now. Eh? What's wrong with this picture, y'all? What's wrong with it? Huh? They got a they got a nice little platform to where they don't have to stay in this drama. They can do their pranks. They can do their little family things and make their two, three thousand dollars. But that ain't what they want. They want that twenty and thirty thousand dollars a month because of the living habit. You know, because of what they brag about. That's why you never brag about what you have. Because now you ain't got to live up to these standards. Because people don't know how you really live in. But when you put yourself on this pedestal, now you got to try to keep that image. You get what I'm saying? Y'all got nice platforms. If y'all just do what y'all do, like y'all always tell me, just do what you do. People gonna catch on eventually. They gonna catch on. Just do what you do. Leave the drama alone. You ain't gotta do this. You ain't gotta do that. But y'all gotta do the same thing. Because eventually, y'all gonna hurt y'all brand. Because of what y'all have to understand is, you can't stay at the top forever. Eventually, you're going to come down. But it's how you invest your money. It's how you help other people come up. That's how you stay on top. It's how you invest your money and how you help others eat. Because if you help the right people eat, they're going to make sure you continue to eat. But when you got these egos, when you got these I don't care attitudes, when you got this every, every, you against the world attitude, you're not going to win. You see? Because everything got to be your way. If it ain't your way, then it's the highway. That's how you lose friends. That's how you lose business opportunities. Y'all got to be willing. And y'all got to stop falling for the, the, the game these people be running on these internet. People have good conversations that can make a, a, a big girl think she can fit in a Corvette because their game is so good. But when people run game, do y'all research for first before y'all send that money. Then y'all won't get scammed, as y'all call it. You see what I'm saying? Everything these people doing is just coming back on them. They lies and caught up with them. They games and caught up with them.
They reality became reality now. They not playing um, what the, the, the video game no more. They not playing San Andreas. They back to reality. And everybody's mad now. Everybody that split like the Red Sea and chose they side who they're fighting with. But like I said, stay out of it. Let these people clear this dust on their own. Because it's going to get worse before it get better. Because everybody that was in the bushes pulling the strings is going to get exposed. And then what they going to say when everything come out? Oh, everybody got a pass. Some people pass ain't pretty. But when people try to change, let that person change. They still going to play that sympathy card. They still going to play the victim. Excuse me. They still going to play the victim. Study owning up to what they did. When that person start owning up to what they did and stop playing the victim and stop pointing the fingers at everybody, they gonna see stuff start changing in their life for the better. And as for the other one that, that run their mouth and talk crazy and reel them in, they getting their own medicine. And they don't like it. The same person that reel you in to come on their platform to get you all comfortable, then start dogging you, getting their own medicine. So what is they mad for? The same thing you do. Dog people, ridicule people, call them everything but their name. Talking about you can beat them up like you the baddest on the planet. You ain't doing nothing but getting your own medicine. You too old for that. You need to stop it and start speaking knowledge or talking to the women that really need to be, that really need help. That really need another woman's voice that been through it. Like I said before, you can be that woman. Quit trying to run game. You not in the streets no more. Everything is not a game. Everything ain't gotta be a con. You can get good money off this if it ain't number 500 a month, 600 a month. That's still good change. Quit playing this ring around the rosy. And do what you do. Quit looking at this as everybody on here is an opportunity. You, you, you try to reel all these people in to bring attention to your platform. But then you go in on them. Now you don't want, now you got people don't want to work with you. My opinion. Everybody looking at this as a scam. I just look at it as y'all let y'all feelings get involved. Y'all was going with that sympathy. Y'all was going with the people playing victim. And y'all thought y'all was doing the right thing by helping these individuals. By sending $10, $20, $30, $50, or $100. However much y'all sent, y'all felt y'all was doing the right thing. But not knowing these individuals had head intentions. And now that it's all coming out, everybody looking like, oh man. Oh, man, but some of y'all still being blind and saying, why they doing this person like that? Why they doing that person like that? Some of y'all still being blind, study stepping out the way and let it unfold for y'all can see the truth. Because if y'all just sit back and just sit back and don't say nothing, the truth is going to reveal itself. Clear as day. Wide open. But long as y'all keep choosing sides and when that truth reveals itself, Y'all gonna be the ones looking stupid because y'all chose sides. Y'all chose sides and y'all shouldn't have chose nobody's side because when the truth reveals itself and all the smoke clear, you gonna see all them parties standing at the end of that smoke when it clears, looking dumb like. So just trust what I'm telling y'all. 
sit back, relax, and let it unfold. And all these people that saying they innocent, that they didn't do nothing, that they don't know where this came from, how that came from, just sit back and watch. And y'all going to see. And y'all won't be looking stupid because y'all chose sides. Y'all going to be like, well, I just sat down and I watched. And now look, I ain't choose no sides and all of them guilty. Every last one of them is guilty. I did the right thing by just sitting back and let it unfold. That's what y'all do. Let them mugs bicker and go back and forth and put the receipts all they want on YouTube. Y'all just sit back and enjoy the entertainment. J. Michael out.